Wow, well this is actually the first video I've done in a while where I'm actually gonna go out herping. So that's good for a change. Not too many videos ago, I did a full up episode on just spotted salamanders. And I don't know if y'all remember or not, but in that episode I said when spring came, I was going to try and film spotted salamanders in their actual breeding vernal pools. Now is it spring yet? No, <laughs> it's not. But a lot of the times these things breed and get into the pools long before spring hits. So now I know spotted salamanders are pretty common and they're not, you know, the most exhilarating thing for some people. So I thought I would go ahead and take this a little bit of a step further and I'm gonna take y'all underwater into their world to see what they see essentially. I don't know how this is gonna go. I'm just gonna give it my best shot and hopefully I get some awesome footage. So exciting stuff. So I'm sure you're wondering, uh, well, dude, it's the daytime. Why are you going to look for these suckers in the daytime? You know, they usually breed at night. Well, you're right. They typically do breed at night, but I'm actually not really going to find them right now. I'm actually just going to kind of show you all what the habitat looks like and, uh, you know, give you an idea of what the whole general area is composed of because you really can't tell when it's nighttime. So I'm going to do that and later tonight I'm going to come back and get some actual footage of these things so y'all get to see it. There she is, that's the pool right there. So as I said earlier, I'm not really gonna go out and look for them right now. I'm just kind of showing y'all what the area looks like. And uh, it's basically this really, really big pasture, you know, kind of prairie, I guess you could say, area. And you know, you've got little stretches of forest that kind of meander through it. And out in the open parts of the field, you'll get these occasional ponds and pools that kind of form. And in some cases, you'll get tons and tons of salamanders that breed in these pools and it's not just spotted salamanders that breed in here it's all kinds of other stuff too that i'm hoping i'll be able to show you tonight but yeah these are the grounds the stage is set now all i've got to do is get some awesome footage so we'll see if i can do that tonight all right well hey look at that it's nighttime now what do you know <laughs> i'm back over by the vernal pool and i'm gonna go ahead and take my uh my flashlight here and just kind of shine around and See what's out, so let's get to it. So I'm sure you can kind of see why I did that little daytime segment earlier because you really can't see hardly any of the habitat itself at night. But if enough time is spent whoop, shining my light around here, I guarantee you we will see not just one, but quite a few salamanders. So let's get right on to it. Oh, there's one right there. It hasn't even been a few minutes. Well, seconds actually. So I'm gonna get in closer for you and give you all a look at this fella. As you can see right there, my camera will focus. Focus, come on. Well, my camera would not focus and he just ran away. So uh, I'm gonna have to find another one now, but that's okay because there are dozens upon dozens of these salamanders in here. So I guarantee you it won't take long. Yeah, and just like that, it's been a total of maybe four seconds and I've already found another one. You can see him right there, just kind of going down into the leaves. I'm going to try and get a closer look for y'all. There we go. You can see his tail right there. He's kind of going into the leaves. Oh, that's a big ripple. But he's just going to go ahead and slink away in there. Let's uh, kind of just keep our eyes peeled and see what else is out. And it's been another less than two seconds, and here we here we go. We've got another one. Now this one is real pretty. Look at that. That's a beauty. Look at that sucker go. That is a spotted salamander, Ambistoma maculatum. You can clearly see on this individual why they call them what they call them because, I mean, he's got tons and tons of spots on him. But the funny thing is that you can actually get these without spots. All right, and I've actually found a few in this pool right here that have no spots on them. But that's cool. I'm going to leave him to what he's doing and uh, find some more because, uh, you know, he's got plenty of friends in here. So let's try and find them. All right, here we go. This is pretty cool. Check this out. We have one... And we've got two, and then we've got three right there. It's a little harder to see, but there's another one. And we've got four. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure there was one or two over there. But uh, yeah, we've got a little party going on here. I mean, this is just unbelievable. All right, well, as promised, I've got my GoPro here. I'm going to go ahead and uh, 
see what I can do with it, and maybe I'll get some really cool underwater shots of these awesome salamanders. So let's get out there and see what I can do. So I've got my net on me right here and I actually want to go ahead and get one of these things out of the water so I can really, really show you all it up close. Bingo, check this out. And just like that, spotted salamander right there in the net. So now that I've got one of these guys out of the water, you can really, really get a nice look at them. And uh, you know, they really, really are a beautiful species of salamander. Very, very iconic for the Eastern United States. I love them, I always have, you know, they were they're, they're one of my favorite ones finding when I was growing up. Uh, you know, when I was a lot younger than I am now, you know, I'm still not, uh, still not that old, but uh, back when I was especially young, I always loved finding these guys and I still love finding them today. So that's just a testament that these guys, uh, you know, they, they stand the test of time. But yeah, that's my little friend, the spotted salamander. So let's go ahead and let him go real quick. There you go, big guy. Go, 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 go. <laughs> awesome. All right, well, that's it, guys. I really hope you all enjoyed this video. It uh, it was pretty fun to make. You know, I've always wanted to see a phenomenon like that. And, uh, you know, I really never have to this magnitude before. So it's, uh, it's something I'm really happy about that I actually got to find a place like this that uh, exists right by me. So it's, it's awesome. It's great. So I'll see you all in the next video. I uh, hope you all enjoyed. Have a great uh, rest of your week and uh, see you later.